And now Esau arrives too late. We are reading on Bible from Torah, Genesis chapter 27. Read in your own language Bible, Amharic, Urdu, Arabic, French, German, Swiss. If you don't understand, ask me any question. I'm reading with you from Pakistan. And my name is Stefan Hegel, your friend on Facebook. The family story goes on with the deception of Rebecca and her son, Jacob. Let's see. Verse 30, we read till the end. Esau has already lost his birthright. Next, he loses his father's blessing. He is desperately sad. Jacob is told to run away. Look at this. So, because Esau cannot undo the blessing, Isaac cannot undo the blessing he gave to Jacob. Already, look, let's read. When Isaac finished blessing him, Jacob left his father. Look, just then, his brother Esau came from hunting. Look, he too prepared some tasty food. He brought it to his father. Then Esau said to him, My father, sit up, eat some of the wild meat, then give me your blessing. His father Isaac asked him, Who are you? I'm your son, he answered. He answered, I am your oldest son, I am Esau. Isaac was shaking all over. He said, then who was it that hunted a wild animal and brought it to me? I ate it just before you came. I gave him my blessing and he will certainly be blessed. Esau heard his father's word. Then he began crying loudly and bitterly. He said to his father, bless me, bless me too, my father. But Isaac said, your brother came and he tricked me. He took your blessing. Look, Esau said, isn't Jacob just the right name for him? What does Jacob mean? He has cheated me two times. First, he took my rights as the oldest son and now he's taken my blessing. Then Esau asked, haven't you saved any blessing for me? Isaac answered Esau, I've made him rule over you. I've made all of his relatives serve you. And I've provided him with grain and fresh wine. So what can I possibly do for you, my son? He couldn't change back, take back his blessing he gave by mistake to Jacob. He couldn't take it back. Look. Esau said to his father, you have only one blessing, my father. Bless me too, my father. Then Esau sobbed loudly. His father Isaac answered him. He also gave blessing to him, but a different one. Look at this. You will live far away from the riches of the earth. You will live far away from the dew of heaven above. You will live by the sword and you will serve your brother. But you will grow restless, then you will throw off the heavy load he put on your shoulders. Esau was angry with Jacob. He was angry because of the blessing his father had given to Jacob. He said to himself, my father will soon die. The days of sorrow over him are near. Then I will kill my brother Jacob. Rebecca was told what her older son Esau had said. So she sent for her younger son Jacob. She said to him, your brother Esau is comforting himself with the thought of killing you. Now then, my son, do what I say. Go at once to my brother Laban in Haran. Stay with him until your brother's anger calms down. Stay until your brother isn't angry with you anymore. When he forgets what you did to him, I will let you know. So the mother will tell him, okay, come back. It's safe now. Huh? Then you can come back from there. Why should I lose both of you in one day? And we're reading the last two verses now. Then Rebecca spoke to Isaac. She said, I'm sick of living because of Isaac's Hittite wives. Suppose Jacob also marries a Hittite woman. If he does, my life won't be worth living. 
so far today.